Health, Beauty, Life, the show, was created to recognize and explore trends in celebrity, food, beauty and fashion, health and fitness, travel and lifestyle. Hosted by Patrick Dockery. Hey everybody, we're back here with Mary Murphy on Fifth Avenue in San Diego at the Champion Ballroom Academy. Champion Ballroom Academy, that's what I was gonna say. So how's it going? <laughs> it's going great. Hey, Thank we had a little traffic in by. here, but we made it. What can you say? What can you say? This thing has a great vibe, by the way, Thank first you. off. Thank you. So uh, tell us about how you started it all. I know you had some construction well, going on. Definitely Champion Ballroom was kind of my field of dreams. So if I build it, they will come, and man, do they ever. Um, I've been in this location for 21 years, so it's hard to believe that throughout my whole professional career that the studio was going while I was yeah. still competing. But I kind of built it for selfish reasons. At first, I was hard to find a dance floor in anywhere in California that didn't have poles in it. I was an international 10 dancer. And so for Waltz, Foxtrot, and Quick Step, I really wanted a you know, place that I could really haul buns And in. not hit your head. That's right, and yeah. not hit my head yeah, having you know, brain important. injuries. Yeah. So that's how we got to this space. Yeah, this thing's amazing. And when you walk on it, you just feel the energy. <laughs> you do. There's been a lot of amazing dancers here over the years. Yeah, sure. I can imagine. So 22 years. It'll be 22 in May. All right, what are you going to do for your uh, 22nd anniversary? Oh, uh, well, I always have a blowout bash, for sure. You know, I get a lot of the highest top ballroom dancers in the country to come in and do a show, and we just have one hell of a party. Can I say hell? I just did. Well, we can always edit it out if we can, right? Hey, I want to check this out. We have to come and film this next time. Yeah, Write us down. We'd love back. to see okay. it. Oh, yeah, definitely. So you can tell us a little bit about more of the history of the place and like how you got involved with, um, you know, why San Diego? Well, I moved to San Diego in the first place for a dance partnership. I was uh, running away from a very abusive relationship. I got in a car by myself and drove away to the furthest state I could wow. think of and landed in San Diego, not really knowing what it was all about or if I would like it here. I ended up going back to Ohio about two times, and uh, the third visit back to San Diego, I, I just never really went back. Wow. And so, so I started now. dancing. I found a dance partner. I uh, found another dance partner and started dreaming about having my own dance studio and the, what I had seen in the last few years and what would be the best conditions for high level ballroom dancing. So then what kind of things do we have going on here? Like what types of classes do you do? Well, we have classes in every type of partnering dance. So from waltz, tango, cha-cha, salsa, Argentine tango. Uh, we also offer dance exercise. We specialize in wedding dances. We have a lot of people that like to come for their first dance, learn a specialized choreographed number, and then lay it all out on the dance floor at hey. their wedding. <laughs> surprise! Like Most of them love to surprise their guests, you oh, know, yeah. that they oh, like yeah. kept the dancing a whole big secret and so that it just really brings the house down at a wedding when somebody does learn how to dance. We have a huge children's program here. We have an international dance sport program, which we have 24 couples competing right now at this time around the country. And uh, they could be anywhere from 5 to, to 18 years old. We also have another group called the National Smooth Dancers, which is an older group, usually 55 and older. They have their own dance competitions here. They have weekly classes here as well. And uh, it's kind of a great asset to my studio that we just have every age. Wow, it's amazing. Thank you. I'm glad you're doing the good work in San Diego. Huh? <laughs> Thank you. So you're here to stay, huh? Yeah, it's definitely my home. I already told my whole family. I said, I'm not coming back. I don't even want to be buried in Ohio. I said, I'm going to be buried in San Diego. <laughs> <laughs> She's a native. She's I'm a native a, now. A native. You know? <laughs> I'm not going anywhere. Well, cool. Hey, maybe we should uh, take a little tour and walk us around with that. Yeah, all right? sure, absolutely. Okay, great. Well. Thanks, Mary. It was great being here. Thanks. It was great little, having you here. What kind of music is this? Is this for a cha-cha or something? What are they going to be doing? Action. A little samba action. That's right. The party's getting started <laughs> over here, and we got to go, and you're going to start the party. No, let's dance. Oh, I don't know how. How do you do it? 
I'm dancing with Mary. <laughs> you have to teach me some rhythm. <laughs> now, I know how to booty bump. No, just kidding. But thanks so much. We're for, out. Yeah. Well, thanks so much for having us. Give me a hug. Aww. Thank you very much. You're a sweetheart. And uh, until next time, everybody, Mary even says it. Just remember to enjoy. Enjoy. Enjoy.